Heebie-jeebieville gives me the heebie-jeebies. Retrograde couriers, ma'am. I've got a delivery for... Ah, put a curse on me, will you? Well, the joke's on you, you old crone. I'm already cursed. Mm -hmm. Ouch! Hey, get away from me! Ah, you worthless strong stick! You had a rough childhood. And I've got a case of the creeps for a Miss Brunhilde. I, that be, um, 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 uh, me. Ooh. Oh, it's so much nicer when it's fresh. Any chance you know where Professor Cutter lives? I have a delivery for him, too. I am Newt, the shrieking bat's feet. The professor lives, um, uh, across the street. <laughs> Keep a case of the creeps to the old witch. Deliver a mystery box of something so icky it doesn't even have a label to Professor Cutter. I hate this place! It's creepier than Squeege's hometown. We won't be here much longer. Professor Cutter lives right across the street. Oh, isn't that nice, huh? Doom is always so convenient. And it's got a killer view, too! This is more like a trapeze than a bridge. Let's go get the hook! And where would we land it? On the porch? Oh, sure, why not? We can just ram it right in there. No problem. I'm sure the professor won't mind. I bet he has tons of porch insurance. Goodbye, fair hat. You were always so good to me. Alas, I fear I shall be joining you in Doomville soon enough. Ah! Winged madness mocks me with a gentle smile. Guapo! Guapo! Winged creatures stole my cap! They... Mother of mercy. Doom has a welcome mat. Is there nothing he doesn't think of? Doom won't be satisfied with my hat. Don't you get it, man? Where next? We gotta get out of this horror show before it's too late. Would you rather face down Doom wearing your hat or Tarara Boomdie with an undelivered package? Is this some trick question to drive me mad? We are in the cradle of insanity! And believe me, when the bow breaks, that cradle's gonna fall, baby. Got one rush delivery for Professor... Oh. At long last, my precious has come to Papa. Papa loves you, yes he does! Papa! <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yes, yes! A perfect fit. <laughs> Sorry, this head's already taken. Don't make any sudden moves. Please stay. I must have you for dinner. We're not hungry. And I'm too salty. Oh, but the weather's awful. You can't travel in this. Rain. <laughs> we love rain. The bridge is out. <laughs> Coincidence. Wow, Franz, get a load of this place. It's so creepy in here, even my goosebumps are getting goosebumps. I'll stay on the porch. Have I ever told you how much I like porches? Yeah, just call me Mr. Porch. Yeah, Senior Porch, the porch man, El Porcherino. Come on, 
Raz, there's nothing to be afraid of. Why, this place is no more dangerous than, than Miss Boombier's yeah. office. Why didn't I see this before? My brother's a puppet of doom. Be jabbers, look at all this food. Keep feeding me like this, Professor, and Fraz's brain is all yours. <laughs> Whatever are you talking about? Look, Frazzy, dessert! Uh, of course, doom comes in many flavors. And with frosting! Please follow me. I will show you to your room. <laughs> Can I get a doggy bag? smile off your oil painted face. There, there, Frazzo. See what happens when you skip dinner? This is your room. <laughs> oh, no. What do you mean, your room? We want an our room. You, uh, you want to sleep in the same room with your dear brother, don't you, Guapo? Go ahead, tell him. Tell the bald crazy man exactly what you want. I want my own room. It'll be fun, Fraz. Like a slumber party, without the party. Pardon me, I forgot. You're a puppet of doom. This is your room. <laughs> Did I tell you how much I love porches? <laughs> I do hope you find the room is to your liking. You think it'll be that easy, do you? Just put old nerves of steel Fraz flub in the room and his brain's all yours, huh? Ah, is that what you think? Well, let me tell you a thing or two about a thing or two. Don't move! <laughs> Why aren't you in your room? The roof leaked. Nope. They just finished painting. Try again. Listen to me, Guapo. You can't cast me into the arms of that lunatic. For the love of Flub, brother, you must let me stay. Okay, you can stay, but I get something in return. Of course, of course, anything. I get to keep my denture collection on the Hoog dashboard. Uh, for one day. Two. Deal. Guapo, Guapo! The bald madman who hungers for my brains was watching. Well, if he comes back again, ask him to bring me earplugs. I can't sleep with all your noise. Uh -oh. ah! Those are the worst shadow puppets I've ever seen! Quiet, Raz. I'm trying to sleep. Ah! Oh, mother of misery! The maniac wants my brains! Not that I blame him. None of your happy little faces of evil for me, monkey boys! <laughs> Operation Brain Snatcher is in full swing. We gotta get out of here! It's <gasps> too late. <laughs> Dear brother, the madman has taken your brain. <laughs> I just hope he can do more with it than you ever did. But he'll not get me. Fraz Flub will carry the Flub name, Solamente. <laughs> uh, where the heck is Doom with those earplugs? <laughs> <laughs> Sissy, stop running from your own shadow. Get back there and kick some butt. You owe it to poor headless Guapo. No, I never trusted that shadow. Hide, and then hide some more. <laughs> the hypocrite, he's running away too. Follow him. 
Open it! There might be something useful inside. Yes, yes, brilliant! Use his own brain snatching tricks against him. Then we'll see who steals those brains. <laughs> so much for that idea. <laughs> okay, let's see Chrome Dome find me now. Ah, please stop me into Arabundi's office. Don't please. Ah! Could this get any worse? <laughs> What's a flub gotta do to get some sleep around here? This is the worst free room I've ever had. Hey, it's Professor Cutter's package. Wow, a genuine toupee. I've always wanted one of these for special occasions. Somehow this is all your fault. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> Blue goes so much better with my eyes. <laughs> you know, you're right. Does this mean I can keep the toupee? <laughs> I'm serious. You should open a hotel. But you gotta do something about the noise. Thanks for stopping by. Take care. My winged pets will take you to your ship. <laughs> oh, yeah, great. We're leaving. See ya. Don't forget to write! I'm always here! Ah, don't hold your breath! On second thought, hold your breath! And keep holding it until the rest of you turns blue too, you crazy screwball! Hey, watch it! That tickles! <sighs> At least my humiliation has finally ended. Do not say a single word. I'm sorry, Froz. I'll just sit here and quietly blink my eyes. Oh, thank you. Yeah, peace and tranquility at long last. Yeah, blinking, is he? I'll show him. Had enough? You can never have too much singing. But you can have too much guapo. guapo. Listen up, you fetid sacks of singing tick drips. Uh, Ms. Boomdier, how may we please you, O oh exalted boss lady? Well, you could drown yourselves in a tank of transdimensional sewage. Or you could get your sorry carcasses down to the lounge now, 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 now! Oh, uh, uh, ain't she something? something? I want to be as far away from you as I can. Me too. You drive me crazy. You drive me crazy. If you weren't my brother, I wish I were. I'll tell you what else. I will. Oh, go oh, ahead. Okay, here I go. I don't hear anything. Well, I was about to say it. If you were to let me open your ears. Warning. Authorized personnel only. Keep out. Peligro. Octo. Cuidado. You are doomed. Just a few more feet to mind-boggling danger. Have a nice day. Yes, I did! No, you didn't! No, I didn't! No, you didn't! I said! No, you didn't! Did you hear something? Nothing out of the ordinary. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Dang! Rock, paper, scissors. Dang! With some tough paper. I've had it with you. Me too. <gasps> Squeed, look what they've done now. Whoa, nice haircuts. Okay, you imbecilic cod swallops. I have two deliveries to opposite ends of the universe. 
deliveries, eh? I'd like to help, but I haven't used up my quota of excuses this week. Union rules, you know. Uh, I'd be happy to deliver anything, anywhere, anytime. In fact, I would cherish... Opposite ends of, of the universe? Ah, oh, that's perfect! We'll take those assignments. Anything to get away from him. And him! And him! And you! And me! I'd say, all in all, it's an improvement. <laughs> Ha ha ha! Ten huge juicy steaks for Charlie Plato in the land of big fat philosophers. <laughs> Cattle prods delivered to the land that time really wanted to forget. <clears throat> if we each take one, we'll be as far apart as two brothers can be. Perfect! It's all in keeping with my master plan. Fine. Fine! Fine! Finer! Finest! You're not the boss of me. You're always trying to tell me what to do, and you only got eight toes and you smell. What are you talking about? You leave my toes out of this! Uh, at last, I take my leave of thee, ye annoying buffoon! Adios, brother dear! Vaya con carne! Vaya con carne con queso! Mm, just curious. Are you guys really so stupid? You haven't noticed that you've been fused together into one big lump? It always is, my brother. Always your fault. Always, always, always. Bagels, bagels. This must be the land of big, fat philosophers. Hmm, Plato's Plato beef. Life is like a bowl of chili. No, life is like a bowling alley. Uh, nope, uh, life is... A cabaret, old chum. And another thing! Another thing? Oh, you know yeah. what else? Oh, what else? Hello, therefore you are here. I'm Charlie Plato, and this is Dickie Descartes. Welcome to the land of big fat philosophers. Big fat whoop de doo Two heads are as silly as the one. Deliver. Sign here. Hi, Diggity. My big juicy steaks. I eat, therefore I am. I shall get the existential silverware. Are you from retrograde? What the blazes kept you? Looks like somebody forgot to shave this morning. Whoa! Yeah. Hurry up and give me those cattle prods. Hey, where are all the people? They are hiding from the dreaded steak loving annoyosaur. The fearsome beasts can annoy a man to shreds in seconds. Only the cattle prods can keep them under control. Uh huh. And why do they call it a steak loving annoyosaur? Because if it hated steak, we'd call it a steak hating annoyosaur. Steak makes it crazy. It'll do anything for beef. Oh, get up. Uh, uh, <gasps> these aren't cattle prods. They're, they're steaks. Ah! Beef, it's what's for dinner. You jabbers. You must have given the cattle prods to the big fat philosophers. Hmm, mm -hmm. okay. This can only mean one thing. We're doomed. Oh! The pain of the one is greater than the pain of the many. I must write that down. Ouch! I prod, therefore you hurt. <laughs> Quick! Get rid of the stakes before it's too late! <laughs> I know I got so What's in the box? Chicken, turkey, steak. No, no, it's a, it's not steak. It, it's a new uh, vegetarian alternative, like the liar, liar, and it's so steak. Give it to me, give it to me. I want it now. Major Flint, Major Flint. <laughs> no, stay away! No, no, don't eat me. I'm too young to be lunch. Stay away! Don't eat me! I'm too young to be lunch. Hey, knock hey, it off! Hey, knock it off! Hey, stop, stop repeating what I say! What I say? I said stop I it! I said stop it! Come on, cut it out! Come on, cut it out! Man, they really are annoying. We're goners if this continues. Goners, I tell you. Hang on, I have a plan. 
We challenge you to an annoying contest. To the winner goes the stakes. Stakes! Yes, very well. I accept your challenge. Me first. Knock, knock. Who's there? Banana. Banana who? Go. Oh, hang on. I forget. Oh, she forgot the punchline. That is annoying. Here, look at these photos from my vacation in Cleveland while I accompany you on the chalkboard. Oh. No! Oh. 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 <laughs> Hello? Hello! I'd like to talk to you about changing your long distance phone company. <laughs> Ah, they're getting to me, Guap. They're getting to me. I don't know if I can hold on. I smell doom. All is well, dear brother. It's our turn now, and it's time for our secret flub weapon. Yes, of course, our secret flub weapon. What secret weapon? A secret weapon. Oh, how annoying. You <laughs> Across the dimensions, spanning all worlds and realities, there is no one, I repeat, no one more annoying than the, the Brothers, Brothers Flub! Well, not that it wasn't fun being fused together, dear brother, but I for one look forward to some privacy. Are you sure you know how to operate this thing, Squeege? Or should we go over this one more time? Trust me. I'm a whiz with espresso machines. Regular or decaf. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Do my... Ah! Squeege! Can I borrow your comb? Newsflash! Philosophers have announced that life is not, I repeat not, a bowl of cherries as previously theorized, but an endless nightmare of pain and suffering. Yeah, I could have told him that.